Hello guys, Eduardo Ferrazzi from City USA. You are welcome to our channel. If you are new here, click on the button, subscribe on our channel. Also, give your like and hit the bell so you can get notified every time when we post a new videos. Guys, uh, I believe that you are wondering what can you expect change during this operational pause. And because I know you are wondering that, so we came up with a couple of things that might change during this operational pause. Okay, let's go through that. So one of the things that might change, some ships might be in remote location just to help during this, this pandemic. So other thing that might change, some ships will be sailing long periods of time at sea. So it's not gonna be like short trips anymore this is my it doesn't mean that it's going to some ships might be selling long periods at sea other thing that you will expect that might happen when you return to the ship during remember guys during this operational pause if you're watching this video right now and the coronavirus is not here <laughs> this video is not for you this is only for now right Today is like August 20, 2020, so this is for right now. Other thing that you might expect, it's only few crew per ship. You won't see the crew fully of crew members and like, no, no guests, right? No guests at all. So you probably won't see guests. I know that at this time, some cruise line in Europe, they are selling, right? You might be watching this video, so yeah. Maybe it's not for the cruise line that you guys work with, but we are working right now. We have some guests. We have guests from Italy. We have guests from Germany. So it's a different subject. But overall, right now, the cruise line is just maintaining the ship up and running. So some few crew members that is working on the ship. Because of all this change with government laws and airlines regulation, back and forth, CDC, all this movement, you might expect change in your assignment let's say if you have to go back to the ship in one or two weeks please be aware that your day might change by the time you come back to the ship you return to the ship also be aware that it's possible it's possible it's not going to happen but it's possible happen change suddenly like you have all your suitcase ready ready to go home and something change and then you have to postpone one day one week one month it depends right we all live guys under the laws right we have to be under the laws because they are going to decide what's going to happen with us and the other thing that is not cool you might don't feel good about it that's why i leave this for the last one that's not really good short leave might not be possible it depends the local government the local rules right let's say if you come to Miami and then you want to go shore mm, I don't know if that's gonna happen so can you imagine you work and you stay on the, on the ship for six or eight months and then you cannot go shore right maybe during this time that's not for you but for those who's willing to come and then sacrifice and work really hard understand that short leave might not be available it depends on the place that your ship is dark okay that's it guys for today this is only one of the questions that you might be doing with your, you wonder yourself right what can i expect but i'm going to bring more videos here so you guys be aware about all the questions that people is making and we are going to give you guys the answer so you know before you come 14 days before you come to the ship all the preparation everything you have to do and don't forget click on the button subscribe in our channel hit the bell you get notified every time we post a new video and don't forget to share this content with your friends okay thank you so much if you haven't watched our series go to our playlist you're gonna see a bunch of series there maritime challenge town hall we have a bunch of things that can be interesting for you show your talent and be part of our family